5-7 for Stokes. Like I said, both undefeated. One from Minneapolis and one out of Sioux City, Iowa, now in Chicago. Let's make this one official. All right, ladies and gentlemen, introducing your first fighter out of the blue corner. With a record of three wins and no defeats, weighing in at 136 pounds. Standing at five foot seven inches, representing Work Minneapolis from St. Paul, Minnesota, fighting out of Hopkins, Minnesota, Eddie Delgado! And his opponent with a record of two wins and no defeats, weighing in at 135 pounds, standing at five feet seven inches, representing Chicago Fight Team. From Chicago, Illinois, fighting out of Sioux City, Iowa, Darian Stokes! Darian Stokes with a big crowd here in support. And our referee for the action is dancing Dave Doucet. What a way to honor a coach. Even though his coach, Brett Welling, is not in his quarter tonight, he still put him down as being here, taking care of him. That's awesome from Darian. Yeah, no, for sure. So we got Darian Stokes in the black trunks and Edgar Delgado in the in the red shorts. Like these shorts. Yep, oh, look at look at Delgado trying to lining up a counter punch. He's, he's oh nice body kick by Stokes. Again back to the body of Stokes. Uh, Stokes has got great striking. Again, he trains uh, with Draco Rodriguez out of uh, the former UFC fighter. Um, great boxer out of Sioux City, Iowa, again under Brett Welling. So he, he's comfortable with the striking. But if he if he wants to, I think he can take this down at will. Edgar Delgado coming in with two jabs. You can see there's a heavy background, uh, boxing background with Delgado. Stokes playing a counter punch game, lands a solid right hand. Good drop, drop lead hand to the body from Stokes, trying to put some holes in the gas tank. There's been three different times that uh, Delgado has tried to land that check left hook and has barely missed. Ooh, I think we might have a low blow there, a poke in the eye. I think we had a little bit of both. He had a two-piece special on that one. Here we got a little warning from the referee over to Delgado. He's telling uh, Delgado he's going to have to close his hands. And you know what that is? Uh, that, that interrupts the entry of, of the opponent whenever somebody's fighting with an open finger. Stokes needs no times. He wants to get right back after yeah. it. Stokes is an athlete. You can see it. Touch gloves by both competitors. And we begin round one again. Ooh, heavy right hand. By, if you look at the way the right hand of Darian Stokes is throwing, he, he's not cocking it. He's not loading it. He's just... Launch it from his chin. Yep, come this. straight from his face, very loose shoulders. That's a uh, uh, technique from Brett Welling, very, very, very fundamentally uh, sound boxing coach. And Good you know trip what? takedown. We got a ton of wrestling out of this guy, and he's done nothing but stand up. Heavy punches by Darian Stokes. Darian's going to use those hips to control position. He's got great wrestling in his background. putting some weight on Delgado, trying to wear him out a little bit. Darian Stokes continues to go to the body, and that's generally a habit you get at the boxing gym. Oh, and it's going to pay dividends for him, too, in the long run. If this ends up going to the third round, uh, those accumulative accu body shots are, are really going to hurt. And if you look at, like, the the volley of Edgar Delgado, this kid grew up boxing. If you look at, look at his stance, he's on the balls of his feet, and he's got a real tight back, forth, back, forth, back, forth. You know, he's got his hands tied. He's using a parry. He's, he's got a lot of boxing pedigree. Well, he's pawing that jab out there, which makes it hard to kind of gauge what it is that's coming. Good deep shot by Darian. Ooh. Turning the corner. Yeah, buckling down on the hips, turning the corner. And Edgar Delgado is on the bottom. Mm, good pat. Oh, great weight transfer. Oh, head kick missed by Stokes. Very high impact fight, very fast paced. Good body kick from Delgado. The, the speed of Stokes is pretty impressive too. The way he's in and out. And he's got a lot of length for a 35 pounder as well. Yes, he does. You know, and it, like when you see him punch, he's extending his uh, shoulders. Like you can see his shoulder extension at the end of his punches. It's, it's very impressive. Great rotation on the hip, which allows him yeah. to get those shoulders out yeah, there Nick, like that. Right, I mean, it's, 
Like, I'm sitting here telling you about the volley and the walk of Delgado, but if you look at like, the prowess and reach of strike, just, just the length that Stokes is using, like, you see him, he's got his hands on his body, but he's really kind of got his hands halfway to his opponent by the way he's throwing exactly. and how he's throwing. Yep, he, and he displayed great leg yeah. kicks in that first round, too. Body. Yep, yeah. dropped him to the body. He's going high, low, high, low, keeping his opponent guessing. Delgado's doing a great job using that jab, that pawing jab to keep him off. Uh, this is a well-matched fight. Well, at 26 years of age, he's at a Reds boxing club, obviously. You know, now in Chicago, he's got two amateur MMA fights. And um, there's a lot of a lot of miles on that car. Like it's it's a nice little engine he's got revving right now. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, he's he's been bred for this with the wrestling background and uh, you know the boxing. He took that very seriously when he was in Sioux City with Red. Um, he's an all-around athlete. You can't you just you you can't deny it. Yeah, I mean he's he's playing the boxer game, and as long as he doesn't get lazy, which he doesn't seem to be easing off that gas pedal. He's beating a boxer at his own game. Talking about Darian Stokes in out. And Delgado kind of going low with his strikes as well. Push kick just missed by to the face by Darian Stokes. I, I think the most impressive thing about Stokes is he's clearly an orthodox fighter. And this, this guy's got almost 20 years of wrestling. And generally speaking with wrestling, you lead with your strong foot, which is exactly the opposite of what he's doing right now. Yeah. And you're more advantageous. Yeah. Well, and I'm sure that that, that that was the, the beginning when he started first started with Brett Welling at Red's Boxing Club. Brett very quickly uh, corrects bad habits, uh, recognizes those in the gym, and, and, and corrects those. Yeah, so. you, you can see that. You can see that. Very impressive. Break, break up fighters, Delgado. Darian's using that fake shot on the lead leg to throw the overhand right sometimes. I think I, that, that could land here in the uh, later rounds. Stalking. Uh, Stokes is Edgar Delgado. Good Delgado, three Delgado. four punches, counter with a heavy right hand by Stokes. He's got to start bringing those punches back to his face, Delgado does, or else he's going to get ca caught. He's dropping those hands on those strikes. I don't know if he's luring Stoke, if he Stokes in. Sometimes you'll see that with the traditional Mexican fighters, especially right from Mexico, it's... They've got no problem using their head as the nail so they can drop that hammer. <laughs> and and it's, it's just like he's fishing. Take it, one to give one. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm not saying that's what's happening, but I wouldn't be surprised if that was part of the, uh, you know, the strategy by Delgado. A fake shot to the straight right hand again. You know, for a straight wrestler, we're looking at some fantastic stand-up. Well, have you noticed he's not chasing Delgado? He's cutting the cage off when he, when he engages. He's not walking in circles with him. He's making sure that it's a short ring for him. Wow. Spinning back kick just missed on the shot. With a nice takedown by Darian Stokes. Top position once again is the highly decorated wrestler. Now he tried that, that uh, weight transfer roll last time, and it worked. It didn't work this time with Darian. Well, right into a rear full, he's right to the back, and... He is tightening the there grip. Darian needs to get that hand behind his head. And a tap by Edgar Delgado and a victory by Darian Stokes. I, I don't think he was in trouble at all in that entire fight. And Work Jim, like if anybody representing Work Jim is generally getting that seal approval is not easy. That was a heck of a fight. Very evenly matched. He just, he, he risked it for the biscuit with the spinning back kick, got taken down. Out of position and uh, ended up, you know, suffering a rear naked choke loss. Darian Stokes, incredibly impressive. Yo, know, he's with the right guys, too. He's over at Chicago Fight Team, Roberto Ramirez. He has got a stacked gym over there with competitors. Very impressive. Yeah, let's send it to the ring announcer, Trez Mala, and make this official. All right, ladies and gentlemen, your winner at the 2 minutes and 29 second mark of the second round by rear naked choke, Darian!